Fully homomorphic encryption, or FHE, is a novel approach to computing on the data without having to decrypt it. This provides tremendous benefit in protecting our data. Samsung's Smart SSD computational storage drives position compute resources where the data is stored. Security and privacy are priority concerns when it comes to protecting our data. On-premise to cloud, public, private, and hybrid, each deployment must adhere to security policies, standards, and regulations set by cloud service providers, corporations, and regulatory concerns. From cloud to edge, these requirements are expanding exponentially to support distributed data applications in fintech, genomics, artificial intelligence, and markets that require enhanced data protection. Fully homomorphic encryption, or FHE, is a novel approach to computing on the data without having to decrypt it. This provides tremendous benefit in protecting our data. Samsung's Smart SSD computational storage drives position compute resources where the data is stored. This feature enables enhanced security and privacy since the data can be computed on locally. The primary benefits from this in-situ processing include the alleviation of network congestion, reduced processing latency, improved application performance, and reduced total cost of ownership, or TCO, of compute resources. Let's learn more from our partners from industry and academia that are driving this FHE security and privacy data initiative with exciting and new solutions. First, Professor Chan from Seoul National University and his crypto lab company will give us an overview of FHE. Then we will experience a FHE demo on smart SSD from Samsung. Hello, I'm Jung Hee Chun, professor at SNU and CEO at CryptoLab. Let me briefly introduce FHE and its application in practice and for the future. Fully homomorphic encryption, FHE, provides a way of computing on encrypted data and its ideal for secure collaborative computing. It's called a perfect servant because data protection and utilization are provided at the same time. Let me give you some idea of how FHE works. The data is stored in an encrypted safe and processed without decryption. The safe is never open while processed. Only the result is decrypted. FHE industry is growing fast through collaborations with academia, industry, and government. As a result, the performance of FHE has been accelerated almost every eight times every year for past 10 years. In addition, ISO standardization will be completed in 2024. So I believe that the FHE market inflection point will be 2024. FHE is being realized worldwide. One application of FHE is privacy preserving COVID-19 tracing app called Kodongi. Kodongi takes the intersection between encrypted routes in a few seconds for encrypt, transmit, compute, transmit back, and decrypt. The other is FHE as a service. Encrypted data is stored on cloud and processed without decryption. This service is in preparation on several clouds, including neighbor cloud platform. Computational storage increases FHE performance and lower host memory requirements. Samsung and CryptoLab are preparing computational storage. When CPU sends a query to a storage, the storage replies with reduced communication by filtering on encrypted data. Computational storage with FHE Accelerator will be a game changer. 
Hello everyone, I am Yong Song, leading controller development team. Now I'm going to show you the demonstration of FHE hardware acceleration. For the demonstration, we use SmartSSD as a platform. The SmartSSD platform contains an FPGA. However, the FPGA capacity is limited and only a fraction of FHE can be implemented in hardware. The remaining part of FHE runs on the whole system in software. This is demo scenario. There is a data analyst who wants to know how many people suffer from vaccine side effect and what symptoms they have. To get such information, he needs to access two databases, one from vaccination center, the other one from hospital. But they are all private. So, if the databases are merged, uh, they need to be encrypted using a public key. Once the merge is done, he can start such operation. Now, use the benefit of hardware acceleration. On the left-hand side, there are two databases, one from vaccination center, the other one from hospital. They'll be encrypted and merged. After the merge operation, you have database which is still encrypted. Now you're going to do such operation. You'll see the difference in execution time between the system with the hardware acceleration and software implementation. As you can see in the lizard, you'll see the software on the implementation takes three times longer. Remember, we achieve this speed up with the hardware implementation of only a fraction of FHE. Next year, you're going to implement full FHE functions in AG, and there'll be much bigger performance improvement. This is a short demonstration of FHE hardware acceleration. Thank you for watching this. Rosario Camarota, a principal researcher from Intel, We'll now discuss the importance of standardization for FHE security. Standardization is an essential tool to enable innovations, interoperability, facilitate global trade, and secure supply chains. Technologies enabling the implementation of cybersecurity mechanisms, such as cryptographic algorithms, must be globally interoperable across the industry, as should be the case for fully homomorphic encryption. The Cybersecurity Subcommittee, ISO-IEC, JTC1, SC27, develops international standards to advance information security, cybersecurity and privacy protection for information and communication technology products and services. This year, 2021, the Cybersecurity Subcommittee approved to extend the cryptography standards series with a new standard dedicated to fully homomorphic encryption. I am the lead rapporteur and editor for this standard, jointly with co-rapporteurs Kim Lane of Microsoft Research and Professor Junhee Chon of Seoul National University. The standard is contributed by 22 countries, and its publication is expected in mid-2024. The standard document will provide the foundational definitions, data formats, cryptographic mechanisms, and security parameters for specific cryptographic schemes that meet the maturity criteria for standardization at ISO IEC, namely BGB, BFV, CKKS, and CGGI. From MIT, Brian Anthony will share a novel example application in FHE for smart manufacturing. Artificial intelligence, Industry 4.0, the Internet of Things, is, is driving a wave of transformation across the manufacturing enterprise. Companies are scampering for the data science expertise to join the manufacturing enterprise. We are exploring the AI and machine learning techniques relying on homomorphic encryption and business arrangements that will help facilitate additional value creation in the manufacturing value chain. That can be done by a single enterprise that doesn't have 
data science expertise in their four walls using homomorphic encryption to allow them to outsource their data science or to make a factory even smarter to bring together the performance and maintenance data uh, across a robot that's used in multiple manufacturers sharing the data in a protected and encrypted way to get more value than what you could get from the data coming from your own enterprise. We've recently published a paper looking at using homomorphic encryption to provide an outsourced machine maintenance service, collecting the data from a, a fiber extrusion system that allows us to predict when bearings are out of whack or things are not happening up to the way that they should be. And that data science functionality exists outside of the four walls of the factory. But those decisions are made and returned back to the manufacturing enterprise. Homomorphic encryption and the intersection of Industry 4.0 will move us from Industry 4.0 to Industry 4.0 plus. Now, John Paselli, Security Offering Manager with IBM Research, will discuss how IBM is building on an FHE initiative in collaboration with Samsung. Well, hello. My name is John Buselli, and I'm a business development executive within IBM Security Research. IBM's relationship with Samsung goes back decades as partners and as co-innovators. We have a deep relationship that aligns our differentiated and unique capabilities to provide offerings in the market that no one else really can. The combination of Samsung semiconductor and storage technologies and IBM's advanced fully homomorphic encryption innovation, or FHE, is but another example of joint capabilities capable of opening entirely new markets for you, our shared customers and partners. IBM has been at the forefront of FHE technology for well over a decade, pioneering the fundamental methods used across the industry today. Our investment in FHE technology is one of our highest priorities within security research. And as a result, our FHE technology is maturing rapidly. For example, we have just released HE Layers, a publicly available SDK that incorporates a variety of innovations that addresses usability and performance. Data scientists can now use familiar tools such as TensorFlow and PyTorch and easily invoke FHE schemes across a variety of analysis methods, including logistic and linear regression, decision trees, and neural networks. Recent advances also include cloud-based deployment components using Kubernetes and OpenShift-based deployment models. Samsung's Smart SSD adds processing power to the drive itself, drastically reducing data movement and accelerating lightweight computing. This provides immediate insights and allows the concurrent processing of high volumes of data. Combining Smart SSD with FHE technology will accelerate the delivery of secure computing to major industries such as finance, healthcare, infrastructure, and government by unlocking previously unavailable data due to privacy concerns or regulatory constraints. It's an exciting time, and here at IBM, we're looking forward to continuing our program of co-innovation with Samsung. Thank you, and enjoy the rest of Tech Day. I'd like to thank our industry and academic leaders that are realizing the full potential of fully homomorphic encryption to enhance data security and privacy. Please reach out to our team at Samsung Semiconductor to learn more and join our FHE effort.